Yes, yes, come in, come in, come in. Have a seat anywhere. This is the one room in the country where we cannot be recorded. Can I take this mask off now? Oh, yeah. Do you know Avon Hertz? Avon Hertz. Yes, the Avon Hertz. Don't act all weird. I'm just a normal genius. I do very normal things like kite surf with presidents and date B-list actresses. I bleed real tears. This is real hair. I program and I have actual emotions. I'm sort of like one of those things that is good at lots of things. Why isn't this person talking? Just, uh, don't worry about it. Mr. Hertz took his first company public when he was 22 years old. Uh, 21 and three quarters. I was worth a billion five by the time I was 25. I'm trying to save the world, for fuck's sake, man, if it'll let me. Yvonne was helping the IAA, the government. Helping the government? I was trying to be the government. My work with artificial intelligence. Thinking only better. That's my slogan, by the way. I was trying to guide the government through a security and ethics nightmare it had stumbled into when whoosh, I'm told, no thanks. It's a fucking joke, but I'm not laughing. Uh, Avon is worried that someone's trying to start a war. I'm not worried about it. I'm certain of it. The only problem is I just don't know who exactly. And worse, Clifford doesn't know who. Uh, Clifford, that's his supercomputer. Ah. Uh, it's a neural network of supercomputers. Clifford is a problem-solving facility. Say hello, Clifford. You're embarrassing me, Avon. I'm blushing. Give Clifford data and no more problem. Clifford was on to something, but now the data is gone. Gone? It has to be the Russians. Or the North Koreans. Or the Iranians. Or the Chinese using a proxy agent. The fact is, if we cannot figure out who is behind these data breaches, then Clifford is useless. If we can get paid, of course we can help. There are three data thefts I need you to unbreach, rebreach, broach. I'm a natural communicator. I'm a. Uh... Hey, you're getting off topic. No, this is the topic. How I've been treated. How I've been mistreated. It's an American tragedy. Kill the clever genius so that numbskulls could take cheap bribes. Yeah, I'll pay. I'll pay whatever it takes. We'll uh, need serious cash. Six figures, minimum. No problem. My share price is through the roof. Look, three problems. Three easy enough solutions. Could you stop talking like you're giving a keynote speech, please? Do I do that? Yes! Three data thefts. 250 trillion data points in enemy hands. Three simple solutions. One. Data courier, murdered on the streets of Los Santos. Bodies at the morgue. Ah, the morgue. You'll have to steal an ambulance to get in there. Old fashioned, analog, I love it, retro. Problem two, four of these vans are beaming vast amounts of previously secure military data. You'll need cars to track them down. I have a sort of friend who has some cars you can borrow here. Okay, that sounds easy enough, what's the third? The big new server farm in Palomino has been compromised. I'm certain of it. No one believed me, and I have no idea how to prove it. But if someone could get inside... Oh, just give me a minute. I know these uh, stealth helicopters. These things. Huh? <laughs> now, uh, Avon, these all do seem a bit random. Of course they seem random, because you are not a supercomputer. Clifford will solve it for us. Just give us more data about the data so we can data it. All right, well, um, get to work and good luck. Pleasure to meet you. You look nice in that shirt, Avon. I like your hair. Thank you. Progkillclifford.exe. Sending you the location now. In case it wasn't clear, you're going to need the ambulance and the paramedic gear to get into the coroner's office. You know, to get the agent's body, to get the data, yeah? Okay? Get to work! Hello, this is 911. What emergency service do you require? Thank you. Paramedics are en route to your current location. Just call up an ambulance. 
ambulance and get it to come to you, of course. <laughs> I thought that was pretty obvious, so I didn't mention it. Now bring it back to the facility in one piece, and we'll call it a job well done. Fuck me! 
see. They harvested it. Is a dead agent's anus not sacred anymore? Okay, uh, wow. While we all think about that, just head upstairs. With any luck, the files will be on a laptop up there. The floor above you is restricted. They will shoot on sight up there, and who knows what else. If they found the data, the Bureau might be jumpy. Treat any security with extreme caution. Intel on board. Now get that chopper! Okay, you've got the chopper. Now you're pulling out the other team. Go to the pickup point near the coroner's office. Clifford 
needs data. Feed me, Avon. Without the data, I'm trapped in here with only my heavily processed thoughts. It's coming, boy. Hold on. Thank you, Dad. Are everyone's thoughts processed? I think that a lot. On the double, people. Here they are, Avon. Data from your agent's ass for your machine. Network of machines. Anyway, good work, people. That was just about acceptable. So yeah, I know what you're thinking. This Avon guy is a dick, but you know what? Most of the time, bosses are dicks, and you suck it up because they're the ones who pay. Let's do the work, get paid, and then go back to pulling real scores where we're all the bosses, even though I'm the one who tells you what to do, but you know. for the magic touch? Data, data everywhere, and someone's getting paid for it. Not 
nothing is for free, people. We are the product. Just a minute. Oh, sneaky. Okay, okay, get in the 
cars and wait for my word. Okay, we got them. Sending the locations now. You need to get close to these targets to exploit the weakness in their connections. And stay close until you've grabbed all that juicy data out of the sky. And be careful. Don't take out the targets before all the data's on board. Fried data is no good to us. Thank you. 
Alright, so here we have it. The final source is at Los Santos International. Get over there and wait for my word.
So we're being paid by some Silicon Valley charlatan to steal data off the government to prevent a war. Because, hey, we're good at stealing. That's the modern economy, and there's not much any of us can do about it, okay? We've recovered most of the data. Once we've got it all, the AI Clifford will figure out what to do, and we'll all collect our checks and go home and feel a little empty. I cannot wait.
the server farm and get me my data. We've got that Akula stealth chopper to get there quietly. Limited noise profile, low radar signature. They can't know we're coming until we've gained access to the building or they'll lock it down tight. We're taking out cameras and security before we're seen. You've got silenced weaponry, so no noises, please. Our first target is the head of security. We find the building access codes on him and then get inside. This is the big slice of the data pie, the breach of the new server farm. When the Clifford Neural Computer Brain gets this data, he'll understand the universe and everything in it. Avon will stop the war, or stop it from starting, and we'll be rich. <laughs> Good times all around. Everyone got it? Okay.
them, so <laughs> you've got that to look forward to. That's what we came for. The data's on board. Okay, okay, now go back the way you came, through the raised control room in the middle of the data center.
Avon called. He wants us to come back to the facility so he can show us something, you know. Clifford's gone through the data we recovered and found something, apparently. But we just need to do one last thing, and the money is ours. We're so close to that payday, I can taste it. Mm -mm -mm. Anyway, round up the crew if you like, and meet us in planning when you're ready. Okay, hood off now. See? I told you they come back. Why do you do that? <laughs> because it makes me feel tingly inside. It's enjoyable. <laughs> yeah. So, Clifford and I analyzed the data. I mean, Clifford analyzed the data, and I analyzed Clifford. Uh, let me give you an example of my sort of thinking. Uh, could you stop it with the keynote thing? Uh, sorry. Can I make a call here? Hello? I'm calling you from a top-secret former government facility. I told you, we told you, to return to civilian life, Avon. It was all a setup, shortstop. Shortstop? <laughs> I always wanted to call someone that. Listen, you're going to get us all killed. It's as clear as the very natural-looking hair on my head. What are you talking about? They're not plugs. Don't you see that the fact that they told you to fire me proves beyond all reasonable doubt that you were wrong and this is a conspiracy? Let me give you an analogy. Why are you talking like that? It really annoyed people when you were working on site. I'm a visionary. I see things. Listen, I'm running late to a departmental potluck, so... Fuck your potluck! This is about stopping a fucking war! Not that again. Goodbye, Avon. See you on planet Earth one of these days. Potluck? Of course. Of course, it's, it's now. It's fucking now. Clifford is right, the data is clear, it's right now. The entire department is out sharing meatloaf and potato salad so their base can be permanently shut down. We have to do something now. Right, well, we are a bunch of armed felons and you're breaking all kinds of security clearances and discussing the musings of a badly named computer. No police force in the world is going to believe us. You'll have to go there and stop it right now. I'll pay. I'll pay whatever it takes. It takes a lot. All right, off we go, huh? I'll keep you posted. Come on, let's go.
Uh, everything's fine. I know these people. Oh, I'm supposed to be at a potluck. Who were they? What the hell is going on? These nice people saved us. Now, we don't know each other, by the way, me and them. If you think you know me, you don't. Who do you work for? Can I get this place on lockdown right now? Come on, you imbeciles. No, there is no potluck. I don't give a shit about your banana cream pudding. <laughs> Maybe next time you'll listen to me. What's this cretin doing here? Saving your life once again, but for the covert operation I financed, you'd all be dead and the country would be in the hands of, of, well, who exactly? That's the problem. This place has more leaks than a thing you dry salad in. But who and why? Can I log on to Clifford here? Sure. It's Russians. We know it's Russians. This attack is one of their signature moves. That's the whole point, Mrs. Rackman. It's meant to look like Russians. We think it's not Russians because that would be too easy. Now, Clifford says that there's a 99% probability it is some Russians. Not Iran? Iran, no. Clifford says, Clifford says it's this man. Codename Bogdan, surname unknown. Russian agitator, hitman, and war mongerer. Uh, I'm not buying any of it. Well, someone just tried to kill you and the data footprint tracks back to him. Look. Look at the graphics. Okay. Can we get some people on this right away? Where's that buffoon? Which buffoon? The one who caused the assault by the museum. Can I get some support here? Uh, let's get out of here. Uh, thank you. Bye, both of you. A congressional medal. Big party at the Capitol. It's been an honor to serve. Oh, go fuck yourself. No, not you. Clowns, public sector clowns. The cloud, the crowd, hell, the cleaners could solve this problem. With Clifford, there is no problem now. Thank you very much. I'll be in touch. Thank this, work this. Where's my assistant? I'm supposed to be giving a speech somewhere. 